Hello, hello guys and welcome back again to another team viewer video. In today's video, I will be showing you how you can change your ID in team viewer. So basically the ID that team viewer give you by default is the ID that you will give to other people in a, in order to be accessed to your PC or your device in general. So basically sometimes you give the id to wrong people or you want to change it later on after you give it to several people and yeah it happens that everyone wants to change something in their ids and passwords so how you can actually change this too first of all if you want to change your id you will have to create a new account on your team viewer or you can get the premium version of team viewer or you can just simply uh and install this account this account uh, this team viewer and you install it so let's say for example first of all create an account basically how you can do it you can just click on sign in from here and from that you click on sign up here you put your name email password and confirm password right after that cancel and it will be changed in here second of all if you pay the premium version of uh, of team viewer so if you want back to the their website so let's open their website for example from here and let's go to team viewer team viewer and from here if you want to pricing you will find their uh, collection of team viewers so here's the premium one and here's the corporate one so this one has 15 licensed user connection uh, unlimited device to connect from unlimited device to connect to and much more uh, detailed and the most important thing that they give you the access to change the id so now after you you saw this and you felt like it doesn't need to pay that amount of money for the team viewer in order to change the id basically what i offer to you guys is the second third option which is just installing the program basically just going to here search for team viewer uh, not open team viewer sorry so from here you go to open file location let's open the file location from here also so here what you're gonna do is click on uninstall and after you install it uh, install it normally like download it from your PC to your PC again and right after that the ID will be changed and you will be able to have a new ID so that's how you can share your ID on TeamViewer guys. So thank you guys for watching a lot and thank you for and thank you for watching. Yeah, see ya.